The 2022-2023 academic session of Edo State University Uzaru, which commenced in October 2022, has ended with the second semester examination taken by all the departments in the university. A visit to the various examination halls, including that of the Faculty of Law, Engineering and College of Mercy, revealed that the examination was conducted in a peaceful atmosphere with CCTV cameras on ground to monitor the situation. With the final examination, Faculty of Law will be graduating her second set of students who are happy for the knowledge acquired so far. My experience in the faculty so far has been great. It has been nice. Although studying law is not that easy, but I've been able to scale through and I've been able to make it to this point. And I am um, very grateful to God and my lecturers for being committed to helping me learn. The facilities in the school are really top tier. The sports facilities in particular, then the classes are very conducive. The hostels are very good as well. Then the teaching standard is also very top tier. The uh, management um, seeks to respond to feedback given by the students and overall this has been a very great experience so far. In my, in my nearly five years in this school, I can, say, I can recommend this to anyone. Many ups and downs, but I'm happy to be a graduate now. It's not an easy journey. A lot of studying, crying, praying, playing, but like, I'm happy to be a graduate. The acting dean of Faculty of Law and that of Engineering said the university put in place everything that will make the examination successful. The caliber of students that we have, they are ready to learn, they are very eager, they disturb you both in the day, call you at night to ask you questions. It's interesting. And so far, we have graduated two sets of um, law student the last set we just sent their names and their results to the nigerian law school i've been able to give them a very uh, structured uh, spacing and um, uh, mix so that there is no such room for um, um, what we uh, exam our practice but before then we have been able to engage them in some workshop where we sensitize them and prepare them on how to conduct themselves in the course of exam. The two deputy vice chancellors of the university, who commended the vice chancellor for his visionary leadership, said the institution always stick to its calendar as a world class university. Hence, everything is put in place on the timeline to ensure that students complete the session as scheduled. As they're rounding up, we, we have already proposed and planned for the next academic session. So, as we speak, we're then looking at the next academic session, which is the session for 2023-2024 uh, academic session. And, you know, as we go on in this university, we have specific timelines. We are hoping that in the next two weeks we'll release their results and we'll even send it to their parents. And then their parents will have an idea of the performance of their children. And hopefully by October, um, the students will come for the 2023-2024 um, academic session. Because we even have students from other states. They should know that um, their university is doing very well. And that now that admission is going on, any of them that is uh, qualified, um, they should please um, come in for their admission test and get admitted into the system. Then generally I also say that for those who are indigent, our university has a, a system whereby indigent students are sponsored. The school management has also disclosed that the post ME examination get, we hold on the 7th of September 2023 as admission is currently going on, while new students are expected to resume the next academic session on October 9, 2023. In Uzare, Victor Odion Acha, NTA News.